Welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's take the latest news coming in from the camp of Black Stars players. Yes, I've already brought you about three videos on Black Stars of Ghana players' performance already. And now let's talk about Daniel Kufichre today. He played in the German Bundesliga against Borussia Dortmund. How was his performance? Let's talk about it here on this channel. Then Felix Ohina Fenejan was also one of the second highest performers for his club side US Cremonese in the Italian Serie A. We will talk about him. Then one player who is also a Ghanaian, he has already switched nationality. I brought you updates on this channel. His name is Leroy Ousu. Yes, he has also scored and assisted for his club side. Let's talk about the details and more before then. Can you drop us a like? Please like the video after liking. Make sure you smash and subscribe button. Put on the bell for more updates on this channel. As I've said already, I brought you updates on Thomas Te Party's performance today. Mohamed Salis also played. Um, talking about players like Kamal Din Suleiman, Tariq Lamte, and Toy Semenyo. I've also spoken about a lot of them. Yes, the likes of Jordan Ayu, Jeffrey Shlopu also scored. Then Christopher and J who gave a hat-trick of assists and others. Now let's talk about the three black stars of Ghana's players who were in action today. Let's start from Daniel Kofichre. Daniel Kofichre in the German Bundesliga today played against Borussia Dortmund at the Signa Iduna Stadium. And um, as the Signa Iduna, it was a tough match for his club side as they lost by five goals to one. That is really, really bad. Before we go to his performance, the first goal was scored by Nico Slotterbeck on the 26th minute. Then Equalizer came in from SC Freiburg, Lucas Holler on the 45th minute. In the second half, we saw Karim Adeyemi who scored on the 48th minute. Sebastian Heller scored on the 51st minute. Then Julian Brandt also scored on the 69th minute. Then a player who puts the icing on the cake is Giovanni Reyna who scored on the 82nd minute to make it 5 goals to 1. And Daniel Kofichre today started as, um, you know, a false nine, I will call it, because um, he was playing as the Namana. The last game, they got a record. So, yes, he started. He played 60 minutes. After 60 minutes, he had no shot on target. He had one shot off target. Dribble attempt was one, which wasn't successful. He made, or he had 24 touches in the game. Accurate passes were eight. The accuracy was 66.7%. Ground was he went in for six and one third out of them. Possession loss were seven. Fouls were two. He was fouled twice. He made two clearances. He made one interception and also made one tackle. He got a rating of 6.5 by Sofa score. And that is on Daniel Kovitre. Scrap side SC Freiburg after the World Cup are not doing really well as we used to know them. In fact, they are even yet to win a game. But now they are sitting quite good. They are sitting on the sixth position in the german top flight that is a german bonus league so we hope that they will continue to do well and amass some points in order to qualify for champions league europa league or maybe conference league they have played 90 matches with 34 points and on the seat spot now let's talk about felix ohene afinejan he was also in action for us criminals i've already told you that us criminals i don't think they are going to make it this particular year to stay in the um, Italian Serie A uh, for the Coppa um, Italia, they are now in the semi finals with the help of Afinagia and other players. They eliminated Napoli and also they eliminated AS Roma, and now they are in the semi final. But in the league today, they were at home and they welcome FC Lecce. So it was US Criminals versus Lecce, and Lecce went away to win by two goals to nil. Ketsi Federico Becerito first goal in the 58 minutes. Then on the 69th minute, Gabriel Stefreza also scored the second goal for the away side. Felix Akina Fenejan came on on the 59th minute to play 31 minutes in the game. And he got the second highest rating, that is 6.8 for um, US Cremonese in the game. And um, he had one shot on target as he came on to play 31 minutes, having 17 touches in the game. He gave 12 passes. That quiz was 85.7%. Long was he tried once, which was successful. Ground was he went in for one, which was successful. Area was he went in for one. He did not win. Possession loss were two. And he was also fouled once. So he gets in a rate of 6.8 for Fenejan. It's a cool one. We only hope that a magic will happen. For the club side us criminals to stay because right now they have eight points after playing a whooping 21 games in the italian Serie A. they have eight points 
sitting on the 20th that's the bottom Sampdoria has nine points out of 20 games Verona has um 13 points out of the 20 games they are the two teams above them and um Spezia also have um 18 points out of 20 games so um it doesn't look well for us criminals but we hope that's a final chance club there can be a magic for them to stay in the italian syria uh, now let's talk about leroy osu yes leroy osu is also a defender and i'm um, a right back of course he has switched nationality according to him the games ghana played against nigeria before the world cup in the last um world cup qualifies according to him he said that he wasn't done with his nationality switch because of that he wasn't available to play for ghana but afterwards he said that he is done and he is eligible to play for ghana this season his performance hasn't been bad at all even though his club side is not playing in the top flight they are now playing in the second tier side in netherlands so in the dutch second leg they are now doing well and um, they won by five goals to one today and i think yes their performance isn't really bad yes that is yesterday rather they won five goals to one he scored once and also assisted once so we saw Leroy also getting a rating of 8.0 the highest in the game for any player and um also playing 90 minutes as a right back he scored once assisted once i said already he made one clearance as well having 85 touches in the game accuracy um accurate passes um were 39 of it accuracy was 78 percent he gave two passes crosses were eight one was successful he sent nine long balls five were successful ground was he um actually went in for two he did not win any error was he won one out of one possession loss were 22 he had two shots on target and shot blocked were two he also was dribble past none in the game yes he attempted to dribble of which it wasn't successful as well so Leroy also gave a five-star performance yesterday to help his club side that is with them to Tobek to win in their game that they played against Helmond Sport in the second league in the Dutch or the Netherlands yes that is the ST DVC so that's an update coming in let's hope that the player might get a call up to represent Ghana but for now the right back position is really really choked we have the likes of Ali Zusedu who unfortunately has picked up a knock of which I told you on this channel then we also have the likes of um you know um professor yes um but professor is now aging a little we will need these guys to come through he's 26 years of age liberal also and he can also come in and play well for the black stars of ghana so let me know what you think about it in the comment section daniel kovitra was in action afenejan was also in action Leroy also was also in action and other latest news on this channel just stick and stay in no time we are going to start our sit down videos again so more interactions and others just expect them on this channel don't forget to like the video subscribe put on the bell for more updates on this channel this was kenny tv and of course, we shall meet later.